Welcome to this uh, short tutorial. I'm going to teach you basics of how to calculate an area. Yeah, in GIS. For you to do this, <coughs> you need to have your shape file as we have here. And then uh, when you have your shape file, make sure it is within the coordinate system you're working with. Yeah. That's the first thing you do first. Change this to the coordinate system you're working with. In this case, go to data management. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, project. Mm -hmm. Projection. Come to project. Okay. So when you come to project, mm -hmm. uh, bring in the the data you're working with here, mm -hmm. which is windy. Yeah. Yes. Change the coordinate system. Mm -hmm. Yeah. To the one you're working with. Usually we work with projected coordinate system. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So click on projected coordinate systems and then uh, after that you go to UTM UTM WGS 1984 for the case of Uganda it is uh, 36 yeah south or north yeah south or north will work for you mm -hmm. and then you click that yeah why south or north is because Uganda has is it, the equator crosses Uganda so Uganda has both the south and the north Okay, mm -hmm. and then it comes up here. So here you're projected, and of course it gives it brings another one, another name, okay. projected. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. but then remember, mm -hmm. this was windy, and I changed the name from here. That's why it is not mm -hmm. coming. But if it was that, it would have come with the name windy. Okay. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you've done that already. Mm -hmm. You now want to calculate the area. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Open your attribute table. Yeah. Open your attribute table, mm -hmm. come and add a new field, okay. which will be an area. Yeah? Okay. Okay. Uh, in this case, let me first expand it. So add a new field here, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. add field, okay. and then call this area. Then give, okay. uh, give it a double mm -hmm. or float, any of the two okay. can work. Okay. So, okay. Mm -hmm. and then after that, mm -hmm. you scroll here, your areas here, mm -hmm. so uh, calculate by geometry. Not not field color, mm -hmm. but by, by geometry. Okay. Click on this, mm -hmm. uh, then you can see that mm -hmm. already here it's you can see it's in square, but you want in hectares. Hectares. Yes. Put here in hectares. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. That is all you need. Mm -hmm. And you say okay. Okay. And here you have calculated mm -hmm. uh, the area. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Of your of your your study area, the area you're working in, whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But the area of a shape file or polygon. Mm -hmm. Calculated, mm -hmm. and that's the area of this. Yeah, okay. yeah, that is the uh, so that's the whole entire so, 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 how many three thousand something? This this is, yeah, this is uh, three thousand. Um, this is three thousand. No, it's not three thousand. It's only three thousand. Mm -hmm. yeah? Okay, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, and that is that is all. Okay. And then you say okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. That is okay. You okay. Good. So...